Yo! What up, everybody? It's your boy, Cardboard Moses. Here to do the last eBay break of the night. Hmm. We're going to end with a bang, though. 2018 Heritage Baseball, four box break number six. eBay style, like I said. So, uh, let's get into that. All right, so, disclaimer. There are over 100 variations in this break. And I know all of them. However, it's damn near impossible to catch them all. Just by looking at the front of the card anyway. You would have to look at the code on the back of the card to know exactly which variation it is. Now, I am not going to be going through every single card in the back uh, to verify exactly what kind of variation it is or what it ain't, etc., etc. Main reason being, this is an eBay break and everything ships. All right? And that, of course, me and my sorters each go through every single card and make sure that uh, any variations get pulled out. I mean, I got a nice list for it. I know what to look for. Hey, that's my hair. I know what to look for. You know what I mean? But for the interest of time and our sanity, mine and yours, uh, I'm going to go through this kind of quick. Of course, I'm going to show every card. I'm just not going to look at the back of every card trying to figure out exactly what variation it is or isn't. All right? Got it? Good. I hope you got some popcorn because even with all that said, it's still going to take me a little minute to do this. So here we go. Oh, shit. I didn't even do the, the old... Uh... Good luck, everybody! Good luck, everybody. Ah, I got it. See, I get too excited sometimes, so. He can't go that high. He can't go that high. Well, D. Simmons, this is an eBay break. So, an eBay breaks, everything ships. Now, as far as the, the store breaks, the, the, the full caser that we filled, all you got to do is let me know you want your base, and I'll ship it to you, no problem. Uh, but we do not ship veteran base uh, in the store. But D. Simmons, you tell me that you want all your base cards, I'll make sure you get all your base cards. As far as the store break is concerned, that's, that's not a problem. I just need to know ahead of time. And I'll make sure it happens. Yeah, because I know uh, some of those Aaron Judge base cards are selling for like $5 a pop. So tell me, tell me what teams you want to ship, and I got you, D. Simmons. You won the AL West. So you let me know what teams you want, and I'll make sure that it gets out to If you want all of them in, the, in your division, no problem. Oh, yeah, anything that's numbered, of course, will get shipped. Any inserts, rookies. Um, variations, short prints, all that stuff ships. Veteran base, however, does not. But like I said, if you want it, just let me know and I'll send it to you, no problem. J. Colo, AL East, I got you. Just need to make a note of it. Done. No problem, J. Colo. Because, you know, for the most part, people don't want their veteran base. But some people do. If you do, not a problem. Uh, m and it's really not up to me. It's up to your peers. So, D. Simmons, you want your stuff too? No problem. Not a problem. Eminem, I think we can. Uh, after I'm done with this break, I am going to put a filler together. And hopefully that'll, uh, you know, help it go. Yeah, it's not, I can't, 
I can't offer any discounts. I mean, I am giving away a $130 box away. I think that's a good giveaway. God dang it. There we go. Oh, Eminem. Mud Hammer! Little late, m delayed Mud Hammer there. Alright, what do we got? Again, blinking you miss it. I'm going to go through this kind of quick, guys. Some of these I got to catch because they have multiple teams on them. Lindor of the Indians, Chrome. That's number to 999. Got a random that. Deco Ledge of the Astros, Correa. You gotta watch some of these cards. They got errors on them and whatnot. I mean, I'm, I kind of I got it down pretty decent where I can catch some of them, but honestly, the only way to know for sure is to look at the back of the card. See that little tiny ass code right there? Yeah, that. That's the only way to know. Uh, no, Gary, this is not the divisional. By the way, dude, you got the AL Central. I did the. I did do the random. I did do the random, and you ended up with the AL Central. I will do that uh, right after this break. This is an eBay break. Got to random that, too. The flashback card. I got to watch out for those trophies, because some of those cards have uh, errors on them. That's the Giants. Buster Posey. Oh, there's a big boy here. Let's get to it. What is it? It's going to the Royals. It's a Clubhouse Collection Relic. Two colors on that thing to 99, Lorenzo Kane. Can you get Ranger base cards, please? Justin, are you in this break? And if you are, then you would know that there is a veteran base card spot. Which means you would not be receiving Ranger Veteran Base Cards. Because we have one Veteran Base uh, Card spot which receives all Veteran Base Cards. So what you're going to be receiving, Justin, is any inserts, uh, patches, uh, autographs, rookies, everything except the Ranger Veteran Base. This, I'm pretty sure, is a, yep, a base short print. Zach Cozart of the Angels. Code 85 on it. And so that lets me know that it's a base short print. No problem, Justin. Listen, dude. Uh, anytime you have questions, please feel free to ask me. Send me a message on eBay. Of course, you know, send it to me within, you know, give me, a, give me, give me some time to respond to you, of course. Um, but for the most part, the description of the listing does a pretty good job of letting you know, you know, wh what you're getting into. But yeah, listen, anytime you got questions, dude, send us a message on eBay. Uh, me personally, by the way, my name is Jesse. 
There's two of us on here. It's me and it's my boy Jason. You'll notice I'm brown. He's white. So you can tell who is who. I sound different. He sounds different. You know, two different people. Anyway, I check, I check those eBay messages like religiously. You know, I try to respond to them as quickly as possible. So, yeah, dude, feel, do not hesitate to send us messages on eBay. Me, personally, I respond to them. As soon as I see them, I'll respond to them. You know what I mean? Because I, I don't want to keep you guys in the dark. So that's that. Kevin PR of the Blue Jays. Now, this one with the code on... code, it's Code 65... But from what I hear, these uh, black borders are short prints. I believe they're numbered to 50 or less, from what I was told. I'm not sure how accurate that is. But a few people have told me the exact same thing. So I can just assume that it's uh, the double truth, Ruth. Joey Votto Deckel of the Reds. They got a random man. Got a random man. All right, so I did not catch any action shots or anything like that. I did catch one base short print, so there's that. All right, on to the next box. You got to be careful with this stuff because there are posters and, and the box toppers there too. So for those of y'all watching, if you get this box, you know, don't get all, all crazy with it and destroy the box because... See that right there? little box top reaction box number two what it do So D. Simmons, J. Colo, those of you guys watching on uh, on Breakers, also Gary, I know you guys are in the full case random division break, and as you guys know, the only way for us to figure out what it is is to look at the code on the back of the card. Do you guys have a problem if I go through it, you know, fairly quickly? You know, because as you can see, it's a lot of cards. We do double check them. We go through every single card, you know, on our own time. Because doing it on the stream would just be torture for everybody. Not just me, but you as well. There you go, smart men, D. Sims and J. Colo, no problem, guys. Uh, and all, like I said, even though we're sending you everything, we're still going to go through it. Any variations, errors, things of that nature, they will be sleeved and top-loaded, as well as all the other cards you're going to be receiving. Uh, Gary, my dude, do you want all of your veteran base uh, in, the, in, the, in the store break that we have? The full caser of heritage. You have the AL Central. If you want all your cards, it's it's not a problem. If you don't want your veteran base, I'll make sure to leave a note for my sorter. I know some of you guys don't want veteran base cards. Some of you guys want everything. That's why I ask. Uh, well, D. Simmons, uh, J. Colo obviously is with you on that one. Uh, Gary is on YouTube. I got I got one on YouTube, and the two of you guys over on Breakers. Jeremy usually watches on YouTube. Who's also in that break? I think Troy Troy J is watching too on YouTube. He has the NL West, and and Edward might be watching. He has the NL Central. 
But, you know, usually we have people watching mostly on YouTube, honestly. Because uh, Breakers, from what I hear, is, is not the best at times. Whereas YouTube is pretty consistent with their stream quality and whatnot. Slide it over so I get some space. Well, Gary, I mean, you 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 got to be nice, you know. Got to be nice. You know, I can't I can't completely take a crap on it, you know what I mean? There we go. A little action image for Mike Trout of the Angels. Code zero one, yes sir. That is an action image. See, I, I can catch him, but of course we go through every single card on our own time and make sure that any variations get sleeved and top loaded. But I'm I'm, I'm getting pretty decent at catching them. Gotta watch out for those trophies. They be errors. Gotta ran on the flashback cards. Gotta ran that. No problem, Gary. I'll take care of you. I actually I prefer that. It saves my uh saves my sorters time and me money, because I pay him. Brandon Phillips of the Angels. That is a base short print code eighty five. There are two boxes left, Eminem. Mind you, this is only a third case, dude. I'm about to do a full case here in the store. You know, we just filled the random division full case break at RipCityCars.com. For those of you watching uh, for the eBay break, we do have a PYT, a pick your team. Got 10 teams left in a full caser. If you want to get into it, visit RipCityCars.com. Not to mention, you can save $15 on your first website purchase by registering for an account. Do keep in mind that code is only good on our website, RipCityCards.com. Does not work for eBay. No, it does not. Evan Longoria of the Rays with a patch. See what we can get up out of her craziest card I've hit out of this I've done about three cases myself and the absolute sickest card has been a Johnny Bench one of one patch autograph for the Reds that was the best card I've pulled out of this so far I'm hoping to change that and hit something a little bit nastier For the Cubs, we got Mike Schwoba with the refractor. That's the 569, I believe. It is. A Aaron. A, there are those nickname cards, too, which are pretty hit, hard to hit. Goldschmidt, Deckel for the D backs. Flashback card to random. All right, that's the second box down. So we are halfway. 
Oh, I forgot about the Robinson Machado dual auto. That was pretty awesome too. But I mean, a one on one Johnny Bench. I don't know, dude. That that's probably sicker, in my opinion. Then again, I don't know shit about baseball, so let's start there. All right, third box underway, and like I said, folks, I had, do have a full case break of this stuff. If you're interested, visit RipCityCards.com. You can save fifteen dollars on your first website purchase. Minimum purchase of twenty-five bucks in order to use that code. And here's the kicker, people. Once I get that full case full, meaning all teams are sold out, I am going to give away one box to somebody in that break. So you have a 1 in 30 chance, if you do have one team, you have a 1 in 30 chance at winning your very own Heritage box. That's a good deal. We have the Blue Jays, the Braves, Brewers, Giants, Mariners, Padres, Phillies, Rangers, Rays, and the Rockies still available. And like I said, it is a full case break. Not four boxes. I'm talking a full case. Twelve boxes in a case, people. That's a lot of mojo. If your team is still available, pick them up in a full caser, baby. Save yourself 15 bucks when you register. Make yourself some popcorn and enjoy the show. And you also have a chance to win a box all to yourself. Could be an Otani lurking in a box. I've seen it before. I have had someone buy one box and they hit an Otani. Pretty much, Mike. Pretty much. Listen, I've I've been I've been live before about fifteen hours. Straight breaking. So it's you know it don't it don't mean nothing to me. Just another day in paradise. I'm already gonna do a full caser in the store after this break uh, any of the people on YouTube in the full case divisional break anybody want to swap individual teams is D, D Simmons is asking and D Simmons has the AL West and he's uh, he's willing to make a trade with somebody yeah I've done that multiple times Mike which I think is going to be a regular thing for me from now on. Whenever we have a new release. Which is Wednesdays usually. Friday sometimes. So I'm probably going to do that twice this week. This Wednesday and Friday. Wednesday, Donruss Baseball. Optic Football comes out. And then on Friday, Select Basketball comes out. Uh, D. Simmons, what teams are you trying to swap? Yo, honestly, probably easier if you go to YouTube, D. Simmons. But we have Troy, who is in the break. And he's asking, which team are you trying to swap, D. Simmons? Yeah, you would have to make an account. and You would have to make like a, a channel or whatever in order to chat. Uh, D Simmons, but what teams are you looking to swap? I don't mind being the middle, man. It's just, you know, time consuming. But I, I don't mind. Just trying to speed up the process for y'all. Looking to trade for the Mets, he says. So he's looking to trade for the Mets. So if the owner of the Mets is in here in that full case break, random divisions. We got a trade on the table. As I go through this stuff. We got an action shot there. Action image of Nolan Arenado. Rockies. 
that is code zero one, which you guessed it is an action image. Payne Kershaw of the Dodgers. I mean, I don't, but I could just tell for the most part now. This is to 999 Clayton Kershaw. You know, I've, I've gotten pretty good at catching them. Of course, I can't catch them all. You know, some of the variations are super sneaky. But I've gotten pretty good at catching them. And some are obvious. Like this one I caught only because I've never seen that variation of his. Alcides Escobar of the Royals, that's a base short print to 85. So I've, I've done three cases of this, so I've seen enough of it where I, I can look at the card and be like, hmm, I haven't seen you before. So then I just look at the back of the card and then it's like, oh, that's why I've never seen you before. Because you're one of the many fucking variations. We have Ian Kinsler of the Tigers with the patch. But yeah, like I said, the only way to know for sure is to look at the back of the card. Hoskins of the Phillies, the Deco Edge card. I would like to see a sick ass autograph for somebody, man. There's a in a case, there's about two or three autographs, closer to two in a case, which is kind of insane. That's a Ballinger checklist card. What's the code? Code 65, but the black border around it lets me know it's a short print. Or, you know, variation of one of those. All right, uh, Chogan, have a good one, dude. What is that? No, see. Never seen that card before, but it's not a short print. Caught that one, though. Jorge Bonifacio of the Royals. That's a base short print. Well, Mike, I appreciate that. It's it's really difficult, honestly. Uh, my, I have the benefit of having um, photographic memory, which is a, a little known fact of me, is I do have photographic memory. So I can see some of these cards and just be like, hmm, you look familiar. And some of these I've never seen before, so I have to double check it. But after that, it's stored in the memory column, and then I, I just keep it moving. It's honestly how I got through most of school. Is I would I would study like an hour right before the exam, and then I would just ace that shit. I never did homework. There's no point. I'm going to do homework at home. The fuck? Got the game fucked up, shot it. But I would ace all my exams. Uh, I think that's... I don't know his name. Yadier Molina. There it is. Deco of the Cardinals. Alright, that's it for that. I honestly... I haven't seen other breakers do this stuff. Uh, I kind of... I've seen some breakers like shy away from this. Just because of what, you know, how big a pain in the ass it is to actually break it. I like to take on the challenge. Why not? Mama ain't raised no bitch. And here is the box topper.
As you can see, it is definitely difficult to get an autograph in here. I haven't pulled one yet. But let's see if we can change that. Dude, even as quickly as I can do a case, like, I, I've, what is it? I did four boxes now, and it still took me half an hour to do four boxes, dude. So if we extrapolate that, we're looking at about an hour and a half minimum for a full case. I got it down to about two hours, you know? And honestly, that's why a lot of people don't like doing this stuff. Is it just it takes a long time. It takes a long time. I probably would do it quicker if I had somebody like pack stacking for me. But I don't like doing that. I don't like doing that. I like going box by box. And it, and it switches up the routine for me. So I don't get bored. Which is, honestly is the biggest thing. Because if I get bored, then y'all get bored. And that's no bueno. So D Simmons, it doesn't look like anybody wants to trade. Brewers in the full case are gone though. Of course I did, Jason. He dunked on like two people, yo. In garbage time, but still. I saw that shit live, and if you were watching me, my jaw was dropped. That was a nasty dunk. Like, that's what's frustrating about Winslow is he has, like, all the physical tools. I'm not saying he's not intelligent or whatever. It's just, I don't know. Maybe he's not putting in the time in the gym. Like, I don't know. I don't know what it is with him, dude. Like, I get frustrated with him because he can get to the basket no problem. He can get to the hole, no problem. It's finishing where he has an issue. And I've seen a few dunk of his. I've seen a few dunks of his where, where it's like, damn. Okay. And that's one of them. He dunked on like two, two people for the Suns. In like garbage time, but still. You know, now he can make that three-point shot in the corner. He's been making that one really consistent this season. Which honestly surprised the shit out of me because he can't even buy a bucket with his NBA salary. But he is now. So he's improving. And another thing that I forget, another thing I forget is the kid's only like 20 years old. You know? So he's going to improve. He's going to because the Heat, we coach our players up. We coach them up and then we release them into the wild if they're booty. You know, we're we're one we're one of the few teams in the NBA that has a really good culture and we we coach our players up, like I said. So I don't know, with Justice I still I still I still have my doubts about him. You know, he dunked just just like you said, Jason. He had a good game, but it was against the Suns. You know what I mean? And no disrespect to the Suns, but they're pretty trash. They are pretty trash. They got some good pieces, but they're really not a good team. But I want to see Justice do that against the Warriors, against the Rockets, against the fucking, you know, the Cavaliers, the Celtics. Do it against the big teams. Yeah, he did decent. He did decent. He had a double-double coming off the bench. I like, I like Justice Winslow defensively. Offensively, that's what I'm like. I don't know. Anyway, let's see what's in this last box, everybody. Good luck. The flashback card, which I got a random. I haven't seen that dude. It's a base. Can't win them all. A Bryce Harper patch for the Nationals. Are you a Rockets fan, Mike? Got Mike Machado. Deco there for the Orioles. 
Whiteside, yeah, I agree. Whiteside needs to get consistent. He definitely needs to get consistent. But that's fine, man. You know, people underestimate the value having a veteran on your on your on your roster can mean for a young team. And the the Heat have a really young team. Uh, so you know, bringing back Dwayne Wade, a future Hall of Famer, is gonna is gonna do wonders for the Heat. Honestly, I think that's a short print, and I'm right. A base short print for Carlos Rodon, White Sox. Mike, I hate to burst your bubble, dog, but I don't think the Rockets are gonna win a championship. Sorry. And I hope they prove me wrong. Because, quite frankly, I'm tired of seeing the Warriors and the Cavaliers in the finals. But, I don't know, man. They live and die by the three. The Rockets do. And, I, don't, I just, I don't like that kind of play style, honestly. I'm old school, man. I like getting to the rim, drawing fouls. And, uh, you know, I, I, like the dri I like the drive and kick. I like the drive and kick. But... If, listen, I don't know. The Rockets, the Rockets honestly can make noise, man. I hope they do, because I'm tired of the Warriors. Indians, Lindor, that's to 560 noon. Oh, dude, it's D. Wade himself is actually playing out of his mind right now. He seems rejuvenated ever since he came back to Miami. It looks like he got fresh legs. And he's out there. He's out there leading that team off the bench, man. I'm just really happy he was able to put his pride to the side and was like, you know what? I am a better player at this point in my career, just coming off the bench. And he finishes games for us, so it's like, who cares? Colton Wong Cardinals. That is not a base short print, but it is a short print because of the black border around it. At least that's what the streets tell me. Heat are playing decent basketball, but we got a ways to go. Got a ways to go. Kyle Seeger with a mini for the Mariners. That's pretty cool. Mini's number to 100. Last two numbers on the code are 9-6. Tony Parker led the Spurs off the bench with 23 points. Jack. That's another team, man. The Spurs, dude. No matter what you do or who they have, they're just consistent, bro. Spurs are always consistent, man. For the Red Sox, Deco of Chris Sale. And I didn't, I didn't come across any, like, trophy errors or, like, color swaps or nicknames. What's, what's the deal? Come on. Let's sneak a, sneak a nasty hit in here for me on this last box. Make somebody happy. No. Well, there's an action image. For the Astros Altuve, code 01. Yes, indeed. That's an action image. Yeah, dude, Coach Pop. Coach Pop is that dude. Yeah, I feel like Coach Spo doesn't get the respect he deserves as a coach either. But Greg Popovich deserves every praise he's ever received and so much more. That guy has forgotten more about basketball than I'll ever know. And that's the break, y'all. All right, so we do have a few things to random. Two teams on that, got to random it. Three teams on that, got to random it. Four teams on that, got to random it. I'm going to do that here in a second. Fairly simple random. I got a nice little system I came up with. So I will take you down that road. Let me just separate these to make my life a little bit easier. 
that, and I also want to build anticipation for the box toppers. Because I haven't opened those yet. Probably steroids, Jason. Probably steroids. All right, let's open up one of the box toppers. I'm going to have to random this one more than likely. So we have Chris Bryant and the Cubs on the back of the card. Orioles, Brewers, Yankees on the front. So it's got to be random between those four teams. And what about this one? So we have Manny Machado on the back in the Orioles. Indians, Red Sox, Rockies on the front. Got to random that. Time for these buybacks, which I hear there are autographs for these. So let's see. Got the 69 rookie stars, Joe Haig and Jim Hicks of the Cardinals. It's pretty cool. I'm going to put that away. And the next buyback, what do we got? Mm, a little dirty on the back there. The 69 rookie stars of the A's, George Lazaric and Roberto Rodriguez. There he is. Boom, boom. Now, let's go ahead and do the random for these cards right here. Mariner's gone in the full caser? Oh, damn. We might, we might, just might rip that full caser tonight, folks. Got eight teams left on it. Oh, boy. All right, so for this one, all right, Eminem, have a good night. So for this bad boy, we're going to go ahead and uh, do the random. It's either going to go to the left team or the right team. How are we going to do that? I'm going to die. If I get an odd number, it goes to the left side team. If I get an even number, right side team. Odd left, even right. Odd left, even right. Odd number nine. So this card goes to Giants, Twins, Giants, Indy, I'm sorry, Orioles, and then Twins. All right. Got the number nine. And I'm also going to use that number. Uh, when am I doing hockey packs? Whenever I have any, dude. All out of hockey product at the moment. And truth be told, we rarely do hockey on this channel. Uh, but now that I see people are into it, I just might get some. So stay tuned for that. But I, I couldn't tell you when we're going to get some, honestly. You know, I, li I like to tease you. All right. So got that going there. Now, we rolled the number nine, so we're going to go nine times in the randoms. Put the randomizer up. We're going to do these next. As you can see, we got three different teams. So we're going to go left, center, and right. All right? We're going to go nine times in the randoms. Whichever side hits in the top of the list is going to get these cards. So here we go. Going nine times. And the money shot nine. Boom. Nine times. It's going to the right side team. So the right side would be this one. So this is Royals, Dodgers, Rangers, Marlins, D-backs, Rays, A's, Nationals, Brewers, Yankees, Marlins, Dodgers, D-backs, Rangers, Royals, Brewers, A's, Nationals, Yankees. All right, so there's that. Now we're going to random these. They have four teams. So this one, I got a little system. Number one, number two, number three, number four. Got it? Good. One, two, three, four. I assign numbers to each slot. So that's one, that's two, that's three, and that is four. We're going nine times in the random. Good luck. Uh, 
And a money shot. Nine. Boom. Top team is three, which is this spot right here. So this one goes to Rockies, Royals, Royals, Rockies. There's that. And finally, but not last, is the flashback cards. For these, we got to put all teams in it. So let me go ahead and do that. I think we do a vet base spot to this. Do we? Or does everything? I think no, everything ships. Or does it? I'm not sure. Whatever. We'll go from here. I'm pretty sure we don't. But I, I now I need now I need to like double check. Now I need to double check. Nope, there is no vet there is no VIP spot. Alright. So we're going to random this thing between the teams. And let's do it. Good luck, y'all. That's one. Going nine times. Top team wins the flashback cards. And the money shot. Nine. Boom. Nine times. Going to the Tigers. The flashback cards. That's right, Chris. You let them know. I'm losing my mind. So take advantage. Going to the Tigers. And let's do the box toppers, too. These are be simple. It's either going to go to the left, center, right, or the team on the back. All right. Again, nine times in the randomizer. We're going to go left, center, right, and then back. Nine times in the randomizer. Here we go. And there it is, the money shot nine. Box toppers going to the right side team. Boom, done deal. Random's done. So this box topper is going to go to the Rockies. And this one is going to the Yankees. All right. And let's go ahead and recap the hits. So we have no autographs, unfortunately. Bryce Harper Nationals patch. Ian Kinsler Tigers patch. Evan Longoria Rays patch. Lorenzo Kane dual color patch to 99 for the Royals. That's, some, that's a little cheese. And uh, the buybacks, we had 69 rookie stars for the A's and for the Cardinals. I found the uh, there's a there's a mini Kyle Seeger there. Found a few base short prints. Like these here. Rodon, Bonifacio, Escobar, Cozart, Phillips. All base short prints. Altuve, Arenado, and Trout action image cards. And like I said, no autographs in this stuff, unfortunately, you guys. So that is the break. 2018 Heritage Baseball, four-box break, number six, eBay style. Thank you very much. We'll get that out to you.